Hey guys, welcome back to another tutorial on the Nice Tower channel. Today I'm gonna show you how to model this parametric layered mirror. Before that, if you enjoy this kind of tutorial, like the video and share it with your friends. And don't forget to subscribe our YouTube channel if you haven't already. So let's get started. So first, let's create our base. Use circle tool and draw a circle by 70 centimeter radius like this then use push pull tool and extrude by 2 centimeter select all make it group like this then use rectangle tool draw a rectangle let me lock the axis by arrow key by 70 centimeter comma 7 like this now use arc tool and Draw an arc here like this. Another one here. And once here like this. And use line tool. Draw a line here like this now use erase tool and erase this additional lines like this this face and also this face too like this So, now let me take a copy from edge of the circle by Ctrl C like this, go out from this group and Go to edit, paste in place, use paste in place. Now just we have an edge here like this. So use follow me tool. Just click on this surface like this. Now select all, make it group and let me Check it, is that solid or not? First select and with Solid Inspector plugin, we can make shape solid. Yeah, that's solid and it doesn't have any problem. So now, Use a slicer 5 plugin for make it into layer. Before that, let me draw another circle right here. Or we can take a copy from this circle like this and use paste in place. Then move it up like this. And also, let me take an offset and delete here, like this. Use push pull and extrude by one centimeter. Select all, make it group two. Now let me hide this one. Then 
use a slicer 5 to make it into layer first option click on that then as you can see in here we have a window first option we can choose our axis with which axis you want to slice for example i choose in axis x inline the axis x with which spacing choose the spacing mm, for example three centimeter and the thickness of layer uh, two centimeter at the end just click on ok maybe it takes a few moment as you can see it's done we make it into layer and also if you want to work in real you have its detail you can use it in CNC work for do it in real like this so let me delete that because I don't need it right now now let me put it in material go to default tree material color for example this color on it like this and also let me hide these additional edges by soften age find soften age as you can see it's deactive we can't use it why because it's grouping group when we go to inside of this group as you can see we have another group now it's active we can use it so now we can select all and just check this option like this so now let me unhide this circle and also let me do something in here take an offset here now use flip tool and mirror it like this and move it here like this and also we can scale it more like this our work is done i hope this tutorial was useful and helpful for you for more tutorials please subscribe our youtube channel if you haven't already